Hello Hinsdale and Clarendon Hills teens. Here are the contemporary and romance books from your winter 2020 Great New Reads list. My Life as a Potato was such a fun read. It's about Ben Hardy, a seventh grader who recently moved from California to a small town in Idaho. He feels pretty homesick, he misses the ocean, skateboarding, and he's pretty unsure about his new school's obsession with basketball and potatoes. Even the school mascot, Steve the Spud, is a potato. After Ben accidentally sprains the mascot's ankle, he is forced to fill in for the last few basketball games of the season. This leads Ben into a lot of hilarious situations. This book is full of potato puns and some fun, fantastic illustrations. This book had me laughing all the way through. Have you ever been judged unfairly by what you wear? Or worse, have you and a friend been wearing almost the same outfit, but one of you gets punished while the other one doesn't? In Dress Coded by Carrie Firestone, Molly and her friends experienced just that. Middle school is hard enough without having to worry about whether your shorts are long enough, your tank top fits you a certain way, or whether boys are distracted by your body and certain items of clothing. After hearing stories from her friends and classmates about this unfair treatment, Molly decides to start a podcast where girls can share their experiences with being dress coded. Before long, her small act of rebellion sparks a revolution. This book is recommended for anyone who wants to read a book about a community that sees a wrong and does whatever is in their power to make things right, and how there is strength in numbers to cause change. Hey, Jenny. Hey, Caitlin. I just wanted to tell you about this great new book I've been reading. Well, I wanted to tell you about a great new book I've been reading. I just love it so much. It's both hopeful and sweet, and I just love it. Well, I mean, my book also has a little bit about that, but it also has a love of family, having friends that would do anything for you, reaching your goals, just a feel-good book. Should we show our books on the count of three? I love that idea. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. One, One <laughs> two, three. Three! <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, are you telling me we picked the same great new read? I think we must have pretty good taste. Well, what's not to love about this book? You Should See Me in a Crown is by Leah Johnson, and it's the perfect book for readers who enjoy a coming-of-age story about love, friendship, and prom. You know, I mean, if we both read this book and couldn't stop smiling, I'm pretty sure it's good. So make sure to pick up a copy ASAP. Because this one is sure to go fast. Recommended for you is one of the cutest books I've ever read. It's about independent bookstore employee named Shoshana, and she's excited for the holiday season. She's determined to sell the most books and win the cash prize her boss is offering. But when new employee Jake shows up, the competition is suddenly fierce. As her competition grows more intense, Shoshana finds herself maybe kind of, sort of falling for Jake. Recommended for you is perfect for fans of To All the Boys I Loved Before and Tweet Cute.